Hello guys, today I'm gonna repair one of this uh, Bluetooth speaker. It's a GBL speaker. It is charge 2 plus speaker. It has problem with uh, battery charging. So I'm gonna check inside and test the battery and see how it works. Okay, let's get started. When you play back a sound from the beginning, it's smooth and then in the middle it will be pop a uh, distorted sound or buzzing or noise. Uh, I already opened it, I checked the physical uh, appearance, I checked the speakers. The speakers, I, I thought it was the debris or hole in the speaker and the speaker turned out to be okay. My next suspicion is this battery, this is the original battery from GBL. Uh, as you can see, this is very fat battery. Uh, fat battery usually make a not stable voltage. So it will be pop up randomly the pop up uh, voltage. So it will produce a noise sound. And I already tried to buy this online. But I'm not lucky because some countries does not allow you to import one of these things. Because this is uh, one of the restriction item to import. So, uh, you get lucky if you have uh, this device broken less than one year. Uh, you can send to the GBL and they will send you a brand new GBL as a replacement. But unfortunately, this is not under warranty anymore. So, I try to buy this on the GBL store. They are not selling this item either. And my last step is... I'm gonna try to replace this battery with the general one. This is 18650 battery, 2000 milliamp and 3.7 volt. It is the same voltage, 3.7 volt DC from the original, but it's it's a bit bigger amp milliamp. It's a three time bigger, so it means it's a longer uh, playback time and also longer charging time. But this is my last resort. <laughs> I'm gonna try this anyway and this is one of the battery that fits to the placement of this uh, GBL. So this is the battery case. So this is, I think this is will be fits inside this so uh, let's try to change this battery uh, one more thing the, this battery doesn't have these five cables I don't know this is uh, yes five cables black white and red and this battery doesn't have the driver this is also have a driver here so I'm gonna pull out this driver and put inside here Okay, let's get started. You can find one of these battery very easily. This is a very general battery you can find in the store or if you have an unused uh, laptop battery. Inside your laptop battery usually there are 6 or 8 of this battery. Uh, I'm using uh, this battery from my old power bank. I'm not using anymore so you need to check the voltage with multimeter if the voltage is still good still showing 3.7 or 3.8 it is still good battery so you can use it to uh, replace this original battery from GPL
Okay, this is the driver. I already peeled out the, the rubber foam and the sealing tape. And we have two batteries here. I need to know uh, which one is plus, which one is negative from each battery. So uh, let's set our multimeter to uh, volt DC. Uh, volt DC. 3.8 volt DC. So the red one is plus. When I change the probes, it will be showing negative. Neg negative 3.8 volt. So this is the plus. This is the plus. This is the minus. The plus. This is minus. This one is for plus and this one for minus. So it doesn't matter if you solder in one side only because this two side is already connected. So if you want to solder this one only, that's okay or this one only, it's that's okay. Okay, last step, I'm gonna try to test this battery. Okay, now the battery is plugged in into the PCB and I'm gonna try to charge. Let's see if the battery is charging. Yes, the battery is now is charging. So, uh, one thing uh, you need to consider uh, for the final reassembly. This is basically an uh, acoustic device, so it will need uh, vacuum air inside. That's why they are using so many rubber like this, silicon rubber like this, to fill all the gaps. And it will reduce vibration from the bass frequency produced from this uh, speaker. So, it will uh, maximize the sound from the speaker so i recommend you are using if this uh, rubber missing or loose like this you need to refill this gap by using silicon glue or heat glue or anything else you can find okay that's it for now thank you for watching this video i hope you enjoy this video don't forget to subscribe like and share if you like and see you in my next video terima kasih